Shane, congratulations. I talked to you before the game today about uh, yesterday's game in Cincinnati. I'll bet you feel like the weight of the city of Chicago is off your shoulders now. <laughs> yeah, you know, after losing a game like that, it's tough. You know, I want to, you know, team want to come back today and ha have a strong game. Now, I know, Shane, you've played in Montreal. It has snowed outside on opening day. Have you ever played in the snow on opening day before? It's the first time. <laughs> I'm enjoying it, though. Shane, he got ahead of you one and two in that situation. It looked to me like it was a hanging slider. You had to be looking away. He was working you out there the whole time. Yeah, I was, I was uh, just looking out over the plate and uh, threw the slider down the middle and, and uh, you know, got the head out. When the ball left the bat, did you know it was going to be gone because the wind was blowing in today? I wasn't sure, you know. Uh, like you said, the wind was blowing. I hit it kind of high, so I didn't know for sure. Shane, talk about the confidence factor this win gives this Cub team. Let's be honest, the team did not play particularly well on that road trip to Cincinnati and to St. Louis. It didn't look very bright heading to the ninth inning today, but you guys come up with a ninth inning miracle, score four, and is this the kind of thing this club needed to start a long winning think, streak now? Yeah, I think it's definitely what the club needed. You know, we, we've had some tough games, some ex extra inning games, and, and uh, you know, we came out on the bottom, just uh, whether it be making mistakes or just not getting the timely hits, you know, today we did. Well, this is a great way to go into an off day tomorrow. A dramatic victory for the Cubs, and I got to believe that when you join your mates in there, that's going to be one happy ball club. Definitely. Shane, go inside and get warm, pal. Thank you very much for joining us, Thank and congratulations. Guys. A Thank big three-run homer for Cub third baseman Shane Andrews. Plenty of heroes today. Four to three, the Cubs shock Atlanta, and the home run by Shane is, of course, our Budweiser play of the game. He absolutely murdered that baseball, and Stoney, the Atlanta Braves, uncharacteristically cough it up in the ninth. The Cubs take advantage of two leadoff walks, two base hits, and then the home run to beat Bobby Cox's Braves 4-3. to three. No John Rocker in that bullpen, and as long as he's not there, Chip, they're going to be very vulnerable and in the closer role. It makes a winner of Mark Guthrie, Kerry Leitenberg the loser, Jones, Galarraga, and Andrews homered on a frosty day at Wrigley. The snow is falling. Christmas comes early in 4-3. The Cubs win back in a moment.